you can't stop there. That's the thing. So many papers just stop. There. Yes, we notice something and it's statistically significant. The thing is, okay, so why uh, is it that way? Because it isn't random. The world isn't random. This is something Ed Thorpe, a good friend of mine, taught me. Ed Thorpe's the black uh, mathematics professor who invented blackjack card counting and also did a lot of other stuff, including with Claude Shannon, who's the father of information theory. They built the world's first wearable computer to, to beat roulette. And, uh, you know, what Ed taught me about this, he said, look, all the opportunity in the world is finding the randomness in things people think is deterministic. You know, the errors, you know, they think it's deterministic, but, you know, it's, 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 there's some randomness in there. And finding the determinism in things everybody else thinks is random. Um, and these are the secrets to, and well, this shouldn't be secrets, really. They're pretty obvious. This is how you find opportunities, is to look for these things. So I'm constantly looking at things, you know, everybody predicts this should happen, but that happened. And it wasn't random. There's a reason for it. And everybody treats this as random, but it isn't. You know, there really are, you know, the weather seems pretty random, but no, there are patterns. And, uh, and, and sometimes there are opportunities with it. And in any case, they help you understand it. It's explanation you need.